the MGH Institute of Health Professions provides three stellar clinical experiences for students. The Speech and Language and Literacy Center, the Center for Health Promotion and Physical Therapy, and the Crimson Care Collaborative. Imagine a place where you could bring your family member and they could receive expert care without concern for any financial constraints and to be able to receive this care for as long as they need it and work with energetic, bright, creative graduate students who are passionate about learning. It really is quite a combination of resources that we're very proud of. My son Isaac is almost four. He turns four at the end of October and he's a little snuggler and he loves books and cars and trucks and trains and anything with wheels. Even to this day we have we don't we have very little knowledge of what the future holds for him. There's not a lot of prognosis for his neurological condition. Access to services, um, even when you have resources, is, is incredibly difficult. We were referred to early intervention through our pediatrician, and then she got us connected with the MGH IHP for the clinics that they ran. I think the quality of care that Isaac receives at the MGH Institute is outstanding. Every week I come, you know, looking forward to seeing Isaac and looking forward to see the gains that he's made. Um, and every week he comes with a surprise for me because he's either walking better, stepping better or jumping better. What I like about physical therapy is that um, there is no right or wrong answer. You're always on the tip of your toes. You problem solve on the spot. Throw the ball to me five times and then we are going to take the stairs down. Studying here at MGH has opened my mind um, to see that there's so much more that physical therapists can do. Now that my parents are seeing what I'm doing, they're really proud of what I'm doing now. There's nothing better than seeing a child make progress no matter how small. It absolutely lights me up, makes my day. Isaac started off with um, speaking in one or two word utterances and a lot of his speech was relatively unintelligible. He was quite difficult to understand. We wanted to help him be able to describe what was going on around him to be more aware of other people and to help him get his needs and wants met. Can I have a car? Can I have a car? Absolutely. He continues to make immense progress. He has probably doubled his vocabulary since we started and it's wonderful to see. Ariel really got him to this mature place where I hadn't seen him before. I mean, he was really following her routine in a way that I just didn't even know he could do. It's a privilege to be a part of these families' lives. It's an incredible learning experience, but it's also just such a gift to be able to see a child make that kind of progress. We hear every day remarkable stories of success from patients, and more broadly, we hear back from students after they graduate of how influential these experiences were in their formation as a professional. I feel like the people at the MGH Institute are like family to us. They care as much and are trying to get Isaac to his potential as much as his family members are, and that means the world to us. So we could not be more indebted to the Institute.